Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of the Royal Family. In the last episode we tried to do the church mod. I couldn't figure out how to make the church event actually go to the church venue because it wasn't showing up as an option. I still can't figure it out. I've tried. I haven't posted that video yet though so if you got like it's posted now like when this video is going up but as I am filming this the video hasn't gone up yet so I haven't seen if anyone has any suggestions or knows how to fix that but of course if any of you guys do let me know so hopefully we can do that church mod in the future but for now still can't figure it out still trying to work things out but we'll see but in this episode we are going to focus on Winterfest in the Windenburg Palace so I know that Winterfest is a little bit specific as a holiday as well and I do think that the Windenburg household would celebrate Winterfest we haven't done this in the royal family series yet so I'm kind of excited to do this and we're also going to invite all of the royals that we know and some of the nobles and we'll get to focus on some of the families that we haven't really focused on in the past and hopefully maybe we'll be able to find new marriage candidates for our little royal children of Windenburg and maybe the royal children of some of the other worlds as well. But before we start today's episode, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and to turn on your notifications. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and let's go ahead and play the royal family. So as I mentioned, it is going to be Winterfest. It is not right now, but tomorrow or in three minutes, technically, it's going to be Winterfest. At 6 a.m. it's supposed to be Winterfest. So we have already started started with the decorations. I haven't like gotten to the decoration box thing yet. I need to put some lights on our house. It's kind of dark at nighttime, but yeah, I just added a little bit. I added these like really pretty wintry trees, which I might keep out for the rest of winter because they're just so darn pretty. But we also need to decorate this tree as a family. And I really, really want to do this. So decorate tree. I think, are the kids still working on their homework? I think they're all done. So I think, oh my gosh. Wow. King Henry is feeling super flirty. Oh, I also fixed all of the portraits because if you guys saw the last few episodes I just like hadn't gotten the time to organize all the portraits because I had to take them down so yeah now they're all organized and now it's the correct order so that's good but yeah okay so we're going to do this we're going to decorate with we're going oh uh can we just decorate the whole thing decorate with uh, okay, decorate with, what What theme do we want it to be? Do we want it to be red and gold? I usually like the blue and white one a lot, but I think that would be like the Royal Family of Willow Creek, even though they're not, celeb like we're not focusing on them on Winterfest, maybe like in the future, future, in the next year, maybe we'll focus on the different families for the Winterfest or some of the holidays because they might not all celebrate Winterfest. So we're going to do, let's do red and gold gold. I think that's fine. So we're going to decorate with our family. It looks like some of the ghosts are out too. We can decorate with them. Their grandfather, King George, and I guess their great, great grandfather or great grandfather, King Henry III. Okay. So the ghosts are going to help us decorate. And then we're going to put some presents under the tree. We can also place lights too, because we have all that like decoration boxes or light light boxes and storage so i'm also going to make everyone happy so our needs are full also guys i figured out how to turn off the random pregnancies and marriages that were happening so someone that told me in the comments how to do it and i couldn't figure it out still because they told me to go to the computer and i was going to our computer and they were like well the the mods thing should show up so I went to this computer and I couldn't see it. And I realized because it's a laptop, that's why. So I went to the actual computer and this is what's supposed to s the, come up, the MC Command Center. So I'll just show you guys this so if you guys want to know. So you go to MC Pregnancy and then you go to Pregnant... Uh, uh, what, do you, what do you go to? You go to Other Pregnancy? And then... Oh, okay. Then, okay, so this is for marriages first. So Other Pregnancy, Auto Marriage Percentage... Because that one will be what, like, creates the random weddings or marriages to happen. So you got to set the percentage to zero. And then for the pregnancy percentage, how did I do that? I went to, oh, did I click on the marriage before? I did. Okay. No, I didn't. Oh my gosh. What? Okay, this is confusing me. Okay, other marriage? And then, nope, that's not it. Um, I forgot how to do this. Uh, pregnant sim selection? Uh-oh. Sorry guys, I totally forgot how I did this. Partner, pregnancy, oh, there it is, okay. 
So you go to Pregnant Sim Selection. Sorry, if this is really confusing, I apologize. So Pregnant Sim Selection and then Pregnancy Percentage. And then you got to turn all of these to zero. I didn't even know elders could get pregnant, honestly. So uh, yeah, you got to set everything to zero. So I just did all that. So no more random babies are happening. Although the sim that you guys saw pregnant two episodes ago, I think it was Lady Carla of Oasis Springs or Duchess Carla of Oasis Springs, I think. She had a baby and she's beautiful, guys. I will, if we have time, I will show you her. So yeah, so, okay, is everyone decorating? Did you guys, okay, you guys all put the tree skirt. Wow, it took that many people to put the tree skirt on. Okay, that's fine. Okay, ornaments, let's do red and gold ornaments and then decorate. We're gonna leave the ghosts out for this one. We're just gonna make it like a, a immediate family thing. So let's see, are they all going, they're all gonna decorate. Why is everyone in their winter outfits? Is it like freezing right now or something? I think the heat is on. I'm pretty sure it's on. The set thermostat, yeah, warm. It's, everyone's really cold though, apparently. But they all get to decorate, guys. We get to decorate the royal family all together. I put it in the middle of the dance floor. I don't know if that was like the best idea, but I don't, I don't know. I didn't know where else to put it, to be honest. So I thought it was fine here. Uh oh, it looks like Princess May and Prince Kellen are fighting, but maybe it was more of a play fight. Oh my gosh, I forgot they just throw stuff onto the tree, guys literally like tossing like tennis balls. That's what it looks like they're doing. Okay, so they've decorated the tree with red and gold. So now we're going to make the garland, popcorn and cranberries, red and gold ribbon. Let's do that. I don't think it takes everyone to do this, but I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna have them all be there anyway. And then the topper, we want to be a red and gold starburst. That sounds really pretty. Oh, it looks like the kids can't do that. That makes sense. Cause it's probably really tall. Oh gosh, what happened? Oh no, wait, okay, there we go. Okay, yep, Princess or Queen Alice is just throwing stuff on there. I I didn't like give them all holiday outfits. I probably should have because we're gonna do like a big holiday party, but I didn't do like a bunch of holiday outfits because I feel like that would take just way too long. So hopefully, I think it'll be fine. Everyone's gonna be like dressed up in their party wear. It'll be like their normal party wear, but the house is all festive and everything. So I think it's okay. So we just need to add the topper. And then why don't we, can you like place, yeah, let's place some presents. If you place presents, does actual presents go under there? I didn't, I forgot how to do this. I haven't done this in a really long time, guys. I'm actually really excited. I started like kind of ignoring the holidays because they were just like kind of irritating. Some of them I was like, well, I'm trying to make the story progression go. I don't care about talk like a pirate day or I don't care about like, what was the other one? Like a cookout day or summer fest or something like that? I don't know. I should, oh, you know what would be fun if we put an ice rink in the back, guys? Okay, so now we're gonna light it all together. Light tree with our family. I think this is gonna be really pretty. And it looks really great here too. I, I liked it. It's like, I, I don't know. I never know what to do with the decorations, guys. I feel like there's so much. Oh, they did place presents under the tree. So we don't even have to get presents or anything from the, from the build mode. Okay, and then I guess that's all the presents we can place under there too. But are we lighting the tree? Let's see. Um, are we lighting? Oh, there we go. Yay. Oh gosh. Oh, it's so pretty. Okay, I like our tree. I think it's really, really nice. All right. So yeah, basically the decorations I put up were like the garland. I put some of these up. I put like this little, like the garlands here with like little snowflake stuff here. And if we're keeping the red and gold theme though, maybe I should have changed that, but I think, I think it's okay. I'm not super, super picky. So I think it's okay. And then like we have the fireplace decorated a little bit here and just kind of like in random rooms downstairs. Didn't do much upstairs. Oh, but I did change Prince Kellen's room. So I made it more purple. So I think one of the rooms looked like this before. Like I think one of the girls rooms did before, but I changed it to his cause I like, I just like the purple with it. It's a very large room and it's kind of empty. So I think that we could totally add stuff to it more in the future, but for now I think it's okay. But like compared to the girls rooms guys, I love their rooms. They're gorgeous, they're beautiful. I love our little custom content stuff. So, so cute. Definitely need to add more stuff to here too. I'm gonna have to like look at examples of bedrooms and stuff in the gallery because like, it's just, it's so empty guys. <laughs> it's so, so, so empty. Okay, so Winterfest should be starting in like a hot second. So I think we are going to, I think we're gonna do the party sort of like in the afternoon. Maybe, maybe in the evening, I'm not sure. But the kids, they need to set the table. So why don't you guys do that? I'm kind of just gonna make the oldest ones do it first because they're the ones who are going to like age 
out first before like like you got I don't know if I'm explaining this correctly, but like they're the ones who are gonna age up first, so they need to have all their like manners and responsibility stuff done first. Prince Callan has plenty of time. He's younger, so I think he'll be okay. So they're going to set the tables. Is there anything Prince Callan can do to help? I don't really know. I think he doesn't have much to do at the moment. Oh yeah, okay, so I kind of wanna add an ice rink out here for when we do have our party, because I think that will be super, super fun. So let's do, no, we wanna go to PAX, we want to go to Seasons. So the ice rink is, uh, that's a large deluxe ice rink. Is that all we need? I think so. What are what are these? That's a roller skating rink. That's a also a roller skating rink. Wow, $12,000, geez. Oh my gosh, okay, this is too big. Dang it, dang it. Oh, okay, deluxe ice rink. Wait, what's the, oh, okay, that's the same thing. Okay, all right, so we've got a little ice rink we'll just keep here until the party's over. I'm not gonna keep this, well, maybe we'll keep it throughout winter. I don't know, it's just, it's not like pretty or anything, so it's kind of just there. That should be big enough for the amount of people we're planning on having. So I think that'll be okay. And I also want to like, oh, why is Princess Amira, what is she angry about? She, oh, just from her hot-headed trait. All right, Princess Amira, you have some attitude issues, that's for sure. Are you not, why aren't you setting the table? Party setting, nope, nope. Fancy settings, triangles. You should, weren't you supposed to set the table? Why? Okay, I thought she wasn't gonna be able to set it, but she is, so that's good. It's a little bit dark in here. I don't know if that's just me, but uh, no, I think it's okay. Oh yeah, but I also did like the little holiday table too. So this is different. We'll set all, we'll set all of that back to like what it was after Winterfest, but now it's Winterfest, guys. Okay, so what do the kids need to do? They need to meet Father Winter, which will I think later tonight they'll do. Festive spirit, so I know you like can talk to people to get the festive spirit and open presents. And then the adults, they need to have a grand meal and they need to decorate. So why don't we do that? So the decorations are down here in the storage. So we're going to put up decorations. Oh, whoa, did I do that? What was that? What the heck? What happened? I'm not even touching anything, guys. That was so, so weird, okay. Wait, did we already do it? What? Oh, we did. Oh, what? That happened way, way too fast. It's so dark. <laughs> is it just because it's snowing? Is that why it's so dark? But, oh, I guess there is decorations up. But I was kind of hoping for more lights. There's like no pretty lights. Can I do that instead, maybe? Wait, and, and also like this isn't fulfilled. Okay, what the heck? All right, per or Queen Alice, come down here. I'm gonna set Princess Alice again. Okay, set holiday decorations. Why don't we do decorate, ooh, decorate. I don't even know what this stuff means. What the heck is the spandrels? And what's a freezy? <laughs> decorate foundation, I know what that is at least. Okay, why don't we do lights? Why can I, why, why? Why uh, set holiday decorations, decorate foundation with lights? Can she, okay. I guess that one is just like at a weird angle that she can't get through. But, all right, so doing the de the foundation with lights and then let's, I don't know what a spandrels is, guys. What are eaves, too? Decorate foundation, fences. We want to do the, I want to do lights for the fences, too. I think that'll be pretty. Let's do, uh, I like the long ones that are like red and, oh, ooh. let's do that one. I think that one will be really pretty. Although it's like still kind of dark outside, so we'll see. Oh, it's getting lighter. Okay, it's so a foundation with lights. Did we do that? We did. I forgot I covered this foundation with some flower walls. So, oh my gosh, guys, I think this is gonna look like, the castle's gonna look gorgeous in the spring because all of this right here are like flower hedges, flower walls. So I think it's gonna look really pretty. I think you guys might've actually already seen it in the episode where I showed you guys the castle because it wasn't snowing when I went into build mode at it, when I went into manage worlds. So, if you guys might have already seen it. But all the fences now have the garland on it. It's really pretty. I want more lights. Okay, this has to be... I wonder if that's what spandrels, spandrels are. So, select holiday decorations and then decorate spandrels. I want lights, guys. I want really pretty lights. So, where are... like that? Or is there just like red and green? Like, is that supposed to be... Let's do, meh. let's do this one and I'll see how that looks. 
And I don't even know if those are what the spandrels are. So <laughs> we'll find out. Okay. So, oh, there we go. Oh, I was right. Okay, now we know what they are. That's good. It's good to know these things. Okay. And then I put like, I don't know if this matches very well, but I put like the snowman in the front. Just like a little greeting, like a little friendly snowman. Okay, so why don't we, it's 8 a.m. They don't have school. They, I guess we might as well just start like inviting people over, even though it's really early. But okay, good. We did get the decorations thing done. And then we need to get in the the winter fest spirit too. And then we need to open presents at some point, but I think we're gonna do that when everyone arrives. I know it's really early, but why well, don't, we'll, we'll invite people, I think. That's fine. Okay, let's plan a social event. Cause I don't want like, if we wait too long, I'm scared this like video is gonna be like super, super, super long. So we don't want that. Okay, so why don't we do, is there like, would this have to be a dinner party? I think so. I think it would have to be a dinner party. Yeah, okay. I wish there was like a holiday party thing sort of thing. Oh guys, when they become teenagers, maybe we can do prom. I think that would be really fun. Yeah, there's some stuff on here we didn't get to do. Also, okay, so, well, I'll explain this after I invite everyone. So, um, let's do the ho. So, King Henry and Queen Alice. Guests are children, of course. The queen and the king. And then maybe I'll just, like, have a gathering for the club so we don't have to, like, fill our entire guest list with, like, a bunch of the kids because there's so many kids, guys. Okay, so I think we're going to invite... This is a new family that we've met. Uh, I don't... Th I think I met them off camera. So Duke Victor of Brindleton Bay and their kids, Lady Corinne and Sir Wyatt, which are our kids' age. So maybe they might be possible candidates for marriage, too. And then Sir Marshall, because that's uh, Princess Anna boy fiance now and then we have uh, prince adrian we want to invite and then we'll invite the kids at the at the club gathering thing so um princess cora of course princess anna of course oh marquis eliza why is she not an elder yet like her siblings all passed away a really long time ago guys but I mean, I guess that's a good thing. Okay, so, and then we also have, we'll invite Prince Jack, Prince Louis. Are they all in the club? I hope they are. May, oh, are they? I don't know. Okay, so, well, I don't actually know. Is Prince Jack in the club? Yeah, 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 he totally is. Okay, okay, Queen, oh no, I can't invite anyone else. Oh, we're out. Okay, did I invite everyone? Where's like Lady or Princess Lindsay from Oasis Springs? She's not on here. Oh, I guess, oh, we need to have King Henry meet her then. Okay, so caterer will have hire someone, even though our butler could probably do everything and do everything better, but hey, it's okay. Okay, so we have our Winterfest party that's coming. I don't think Father Winter comes, yeah, he doesn't come until 8 p.m. So he's going to be here like after everyone has definitely already left. Oh my gosh, the party outfits, guys, they're just, they're they're great. They're fabulous. Yeah, I was wondering if I should do something a little bit more festive, but I really think it's okay. I, do, I don't know if I showed you guys this, but I like sort of found something for Prince Kellen that's purple and pink because I was struggling when he had first turned into a child to find outfits that were still the Windenburg colors, the purple and pink. So this was what I found. The suit is white, the inside shirt is pink, and the bow tie is purple. So I think that's about as close as we're going to get. But I don't know. I don't know how I feel about it, but it'll... It's fine for now. It'll be okay. Okay, so our guests, of course, are going to take a really long time to get here because they always do. Have we had a party, though, since I flipped the palace? I don't think I did because I the palace, the front door used to be facing this way, but now it's facing the other way, now facing this way. So I think I had a gate here in the back before, though, so I think it's really going to take about the same amount of time for people to get here. Also, I realized we're having a dinner party and it's 8 a.m. Whoops. <laughs> Oh, well, I didn't mean to do that, but, oh, okay. So, uh, so we had the royal, uh, royal, oh, what is it? Car uh, Monarchy Career Mod come out two episodes ago. And uh, someone pointed out that, like, they don't, they think it's better to register with the ministry. I almost said the Ministry of Magic. Register with the Ministry of of jobs is that what it's called um the yeah you can register your job and someone said it's be probably better to do that and just put king and duke and all of that because now like anyone can be a duke like y like you know so I, I don't know how random it is for that and also people were like questioning the order of everything too because i guess like so the archduke and all of that apparently is like german um 
So maybe we will just do like a self-employed thing. I haven't really decided yet. I'm still still thinking about it. So I, I know there's some stuff that I mentioned in like past episodes that will just have to have to show up later in, in the next episodes. Like I know that I also said that, uh, what's her name? Uh, Lady Pearl McWilliams, that she was probably going to break up with Sir Derek of Windenburg because... If you want to know why, you're going to have to go back and watch that episode. But uh, I think it was like four episodes ago. But yeah, I was going to have a break up with him, but I haven't done that yet. So maybe we'll do that in this episode. Depends how much time we have. So we're going to have the the chef, I guess, the cook, make a nice meal. And why are we all down here? Okay, so this is this our butler at the moment? They all keep switching. Okay, so ask her to... Butler, assign task, and cook a party meal. Oh, you can't even pick what party meal. We wanted her to cook like a festive meal though. I forgot how long this dress is. Like it just glitches into the ground kind of, but it's very, very pretty guys. I like it. It's very simple for sure, but I like it. I love her jewelry and stuff with it too. She's so pretty guys. I love her royal outfits. I'm so glad I'm able to like actually have custom content now. Who did I ask to... to to have her make a meal. Where did she go? I don't actually know where she went. Wait, what? I'm so confused. Okay, I don't know what's happening. I don't know who I, who did I just have the ask the butler to make a meal? I, was it Prince Kellen? I might have accidentally done that. Um, okay, so why don't we have... Well, who's calling you? Hi, Queen Alice. The impression you've done... Someone's offering her a job in the social media career. No, we're not going to do that. That's not... No, that doesn't fit our... What are you doing? Was someone just doing sit-ups out here? You're freezing! Get inside, people! Oh my gosh. Oh, I swear, if we have anyone pass out out here... Oh my gosh, Lady Corinne! <gasps> Get inside! Oh my gosh, guys! Everybody is blue! I swear if anyone dies, that is not happening. I'm saving now in case anyone dies. I'm gonna be like, no! You're not allowed. You're not allowed to die. I swear to God if anyone dies on us. Because when we were having, like, parties in the last winter, like, I'm pretty sure it's been a year since it was... Yeah, obviously it's been a year since it was winter. But that's when, that's when Queen Isabel died, guys. She died because of the cold. So I don't want anyone else dying on our watch. So we have people crowded around the tree. I think it's time. Let's open presents. Start at 1 p.m. Oh gosh. Oh my god. Okay, we're almost out of time. We need to have like, like. Oh, it's not. A, it's not a gold event. You. I know you guys can't see this because my camera's here, but I didn't make it a gold event. So we don't have to like reach any goals about about like eating dinner and stuff. But it would still be nice to do that since it's like a dinner party technically. But. Can we open presents? Can we do that now? Sneak a present. Sims with good or family-oriented traits are too morally under upstanding to sneak presents early. That's funny. Okay. Add present. Yes. And then we can open presents too. Are you like really hungry or something? Can we? Oh, yeah. So this is a Sir Wyatt. Oh, Princess Amira is going to give Sir Wyatt a Winterfest gift. Let's give him one of our, our cards. I think that'll be good. So what are you wearing, Marky Eliza? Is this, your, is this your cold weather outfit? Oh my gosh, I need to change that if it is. I do not like that at all. That is not not okay. Oh right, we need to have a we need to have a gathering to invite all all of our all of the kids. So start gathering. And then they can come over and we'll have our kids with us too. It always takes them so much less time to show up, which I think is so strange. Like, oh my gosh, are you guys okay? Oh, I don't know who that is. I don't care about her. <gasps> Oh my god, he just slipped! Our caterer just slipped! Are we gonna get sued? Oh my gosh! He's not blue or anything though, so that's good. Oh my gosh, this stinks! When you invite people for a party and it's winter, they come in their party clothes, so they're all freezing, guys. They're so cold! I feel so bad! Oh my god! Okay, Queen Alice, why don't you talk to your sister-in-law? Wait, you totally know your sister-in-law! What? Polite introduction. You know her! What are you talking about? <laughs> What is going on here? Okay, this is Lady Corinne, so I'm gonna have Prince Kellen introduce- or no, he already knows her. I'm gonna have him give her a gift. Okay. Oh, yay! We earned a lot of money on our holiday. That's good. Okay, so why don't you give her a Winterfest gift? Aw, oh, you can give her your, your little card, too. Did Princess Amira- did she- wait, did she already give you your Winterfest gift? Uh, no. Why aren't you giving your gift? Oh, you're right there. Can you give him your gift? And is this gonna go well? Is he gonna like it? We'll see. We shall see, guys. 
Okay, does he like it? He does! He likes the gift! Yay! Oh, and she gained empathy, guys. That's good. That's really good. Okay. Oh, and so did Prince Kellen. It looked like she liked the gift, too. That's awesome! Okay. Yay! I love giving the gifts, guys. It's really cute. Okay, so it looks like he's actually getting along really well with Lady Corinne. Do you think this is a possible candidate for marriage? Oh, we earned a- oh, our party's over. <laughs> that was- <laughs> <laughs> that was not a very successful party that didn't last long at all. I'm about to like have another dinner party just to invite people over, but I don't want people to get freezing cold. So yeah, maybe we'll just invite like our friends and stuff like, oh wait, you're not in the club. Wait, what? Wait, what? What happened to our king and queen club? Did I delete that or something? Wait, wait guys, what? They were totally in the kings and queen club. I'm very confused right now. Where did that club go? What happened to it? Oh, wait, what? Is it because, oh, it's because they all had to be in the political career to do the Kings and Queens Club. And then now that all of them are out of it, I think the club just disappeared because it didn't have any members. Well, shoot. Okay, well, I need to do that again then. And then I should also probably figure out what our careers are gonna be. Like if, if I'm going to register with the ministry for like self-employment and be like king and queen, or if we're gonna stick with this monarchy career. Oh, guys, this is complex. Oh my gosh, we didn't even get to ice skate together. Okay, well, I'm gonna have all of the kids ice skate then. So invite to skate all of our friends. All of them are here. Oh, and Lady Corinne and Sir Wyatt too. We have to, I guess, oh. Should I have another club? I think so. I think we're gonna have another club that Lady, that Princess Amir is going to make. I think it would be like a girl, like a little a little girls club. I think that'd be really cute. That's totally something she would do too, you know? Like, like this is all the popular girls. This is all the rich royal kids. I feel like that's definitely something Princess Amir would do. So we'll, oh my gosh, guys, it's way too cold for them. <gasps> Change it to your winter outfits, no! Oh my gosh, no, none of the kids. Oh my God, there's like a blizzard going on right now, guys. It is way too cold. These poor kids. No, why are you skating in your dresses? <gasps> what is happening, guys? Why? Are you in your athletic outfit? What are these outfits? No, no, the kids are not allowed to turn blue. Are they going to turn blue? Is is Princess Naya turning blue? I think, I think she is. I don't know. She looks discolored or something. What is, okay, forget this. No, this is this was a fail. Hey, King Henry, I'm Duchess. We haven't met, but my friend just gushes about how great a person you are. So I thought I'd try to play matchmaker. No, no, we're married. Calm down, woman, jeez. Oh my gosh, okay. Oh, I wish like pools froze over in the winter time. That would be kind of cool. Man, but it would be so, so cold. All right, why don't we just have the kids all like, like, oh, oh, we need to open presents, okay. So, open presents with all our family and friends, everyone who's over. Oh, wait, Prince Jack, okay, I guess they're all here. I didn't see Princess Belle at all. Oh, Princess Anna was here too. We didn't even really, oh my gosh, Queen Alice, you look ridiculous dancing in your dress because it's like going into the ground. Why don't you change your outfit into like this? Oh, this one's pretty, I love this outfit, okay. So, uh, let's see, we need, okay, well, she's, she, she's gonna open, oh no, there you go, okay. So, are we opening presents? Did Queen Alice open her gift? Wait, what, what is happening? Why are we not opening? Open, open all your presents. Let's open all your presents with all your friends. What is happening, guys? I, do we have to, like, wait for them or something? What are you wearing? This is Prince Johan. We need to change his outfit, guys. That's that's not that's not okay. I'm not okay with this outfit. Okay, so we have everyone here to open presents. And what now now Princess Amir is leaving. Why are you leaving? Oh my gosh, guys, there's too many notifications happening right now. Princess May got one blarfy. What is a blarfy? Okay, so Prince Kellen is he opened his present just now. And then what are you wearing, Princess Naya? That is not an outfit I picked for you. He got one purple pursuer action figure. I think he already has that, but okay. Oh, there's Princess Belle. Wait, no, Princess Belle, come back. Wait, 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 where are you going? We love you. Wait, why don't you know Princess Belle? That's your that's your niece. Why don't you should know all the these kids? What is happening? Okay. Well, introduce yourself to all of the kids so you know them, because you should. This is also your nephew. Okay, you already know him, so that's good. So, oh, and then, oh, Marquis is still here. And then, I don't know what the other kids are. <gasps> no, Prince Kellen. 
Oh my god. Oh my god, you're gonna get in so much trouble. No. Parenting. Uh, discipline. You are going- we're gonna be strict now. Well, yeah, yeah, we're gonna be strict. Yell at him for making a mess, because that is not okay. We're not okay with this. Prince Kellen, you're gonna have to clean this up, like, right away, too. So, clean up. I think your mom already yelled at you. Okay, so we opened gifts, I guess. Why are people calling us? I'm ignoring all the calls right now, because I do not want any more calls. Okay, so open, just open a present. Oh, and then Princess Amira is opening her present right now, too. Okay, so did she get something good? I, I would laugh so hard if a Princess Amira got coal, guys. I feel like if anyone were to, it'd be her, but she didn't. She got a violin. That's cool. Maybe she'll start playing the violin more. Okay, so she's opened her gift, and then uh, King Henry needs to open his gift. And why is Princess Naya sad? What's wrong? We're, why don't we give you a gift? Uh, let's give her one of our cards. Even though we're not like really that close with her, but th that's okay. We'll give her a card. So I think it'll be okay. I, I, uh, guys, Princess Amira is just like, why, also, like, what are you, what are you wearing, Princess Day? I know I've already said this, but like, <laughs> seriously, what are you wearing? Um, yeah, I don't know, Princess Amira, I think she's still trying to make friends. I think she's growing, so that's good. And it gives her more empathy. No, no, and you're making a huge mess. Oh my gosh, stop, stop. Oh, you're gonna get in so much trouble. We're not okay with this. Parenting, discipline, be recent behavior. Yell at her for making a mess. We're not okay with that. You need to clean that up, too. Yeah, that's not okay. Did uh, King Henry get a gift? Oh, whoops. Okay. Uh, King Henry received one... Wait. One motion monitor gaming mat. Oh, that's cool. We don't have that. I can put that somewhere. Okay, and then Queen Alice is opening her present, too. So, she got... Let's see. I don't see any notifications. She got... A yoga mat. Maybe she could start. Wait, we have yoga. We have a yoga mat upstairs for real. Like that's that you already have that. Okay, so why don't we have Princess or Queen? Oh my God! Why do I keep doing that? Have Queen Alice cook a grand meal. We'll do a turkey dinner, and because I don't think you can ask the butler to do that, so we'll have her do that. And then Princess Anna is still here, and she needs to go to the bathroom. Then go to the bathroom. You're welcome to use our restroom. Like it's mine. And then uh, Father Winter should be here pretty soon too. So, I don't know where- Oh, it looks like all the kids are still here! Yay! Okay, so, is this- That's Prince Louis, that's her cousin. Princess- Oh, that's- that's us. That's Princess May. And then, uh, Prince Jack. Prince- Wait, where's the other- the other ones? Where are the ones from Brindleton Bay? Prince Johan, where are you? I think you're- I think he's here. Why is he just- Oh, he's trying on outfits and he changed into a hot dog suit. <laughs> <laughs> no, what are you doing? Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm gonna have Princess Amira give him. Oh wow, she's giving away all of her cards, guys. She's a feeling very generous today. I'm gonna have her. <laughs> guys, the hot dog suit. I can't get over it. <laughs> um, I'm having her give him a present. So Prince Johan is like supposed. He has to marry either Princess Amira or Princess May because that was what his father promised. Prince or King George, their grandfather. So he's going, he like has to choose one of them at least. So we'll, we'll see who gets along with him the most. I'm trying to think of like other candidates for them. One of the Oasis Springs children could be a good candidate, although I think they're all younger than they are. And then uh, let's see. And then Princess May, why don't you also give Prince Johan a gift? So give him a, give him this action figure. He would totally like that. So, yeah, we'll kind of see who gets along with him more. Right now, it looks like they're both, like, they're not very close with him. So, it looks like they're both kind of on, like, even, even turf. I don't even know, like, who's interested in him more. I, yeah, I don't know. Well, we'll, we'll kind of just have to see how that goes. But, let's see. I think, so we totally like Princess Amira's present. Is he gonna like Princess May's present? I think so. Yeah, he liked it too. With kids, it's so much easier to get them to like presents. I feel like with the adults, it's like really hard for some reason. Oh, I also need to get them to join the scouts. Wait, are you guys already in scouts or something? Wait, then how do you, what do you do for scouts? To progress through the scouting ranks, scouts must perform good deeds. Okay, do we have any badges though? I don't know. I need to pay more attention to that because I have not. And I mean, not like they're gonna age up into teenagers like anytime soon, but you know, yeah, we still have, we still have a long time, so. <laughs> That's okay. Okay, so we're going to... Is Father Winter here yet? Because it's like nine. Like, like, seriously, we're... Uh, burn money. <laughs> That's what rich people do. Father Winter's here, guys! Does he have a brown beard? What? 
This is not the Father Winter that we know. This is not the Father Winter that we know. Guys, this is an imposter. I'm not okay with this. <laughs> oh my gosh, polite introduction. That is not the one we know, guys. That is a different Father Winter for sure. I did not know that it could be anybody else. It's supposed to be Clement Frost. Oh, uh, did people already dig into our meal? Yeah, there's like random plates lying around. Did people dig in? It looks like it's been untouched. No, I think people did dig in. That's okay, people are hungry. So I'm gonna put this up here where our table is. So people can actually eat up here. And I think all, was all you had to do was eat it. Grand meal. Uh, most delectable feast always awaits. Cook a grand meal. And then start the feast. Oh. Oh. S call the grand meal. I think that's all we have to do. And then we need people to interact with Father Winter too. So why don't you... Let's see. I think just do a friendly introduction for now. And then I guess... I think... Are you supposed to like ask him for a present or something? Friendly introduction. Oh my god, what are you wearing, Princess May? You must have been trying on outfits. What is happening? Oh my gosh, why? <laughs> Princess Alice just decided to shower at her house. That's fine. All right. Princess May, what are you wearing? You're playing like dress up for real. Oh my gosh. That is. Oh my god, guys, our butler. <laughs> no. Princess Amira is like, uh, guys, someone please help our butler. You know, she'd have that reaction too. She'd be like, um, what is happening? I think that's totally what she's doing right now. Oh my god, guys! Okay, Queen Alice, did you call people to the grand meal yet? Yes, you did. You just- oh my god. Oh, I didn't even see Princess Naya there. I saw Princess Anna coming up, and then it looked like she, like, turned into Princess Naya. That was super weird. Okay, I- this video's really- getting really long, so I think we have to stop it, but, I mean, we- I mean, like, I haven't fulfilled, like, totally everything in Winterfest, but I don't think you guys need to see that. I think it's fine. But let me know what you guys think about, uh, Lady Corinne of Brindleton Bay and Sir Wyatt, and then also, like, who you think would be better with, like, who are you voting for- to end up with Prince Johan of Brindleton Bay, because they would be the future queen of Brindleton Bay. So, yeah, let me know what you guys think, but I'm gonna end this episode here. In the next episode, I still want to focus on the kids a lot. I keep saying I want to go back to the family of Willow Creek, which I do. We'll go back to them, focus on them, have the kids, like, like, I still want to explore this whole marriage candidate thing and, and like see what's going on. We also need to kind of focus on the kids of, of Oasis Springs as well. But we're going to end this episode here. I hope you guys enjoyed this. If you did, give it a big thumbs up. And also, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. And don't forget to turn on your notifications. And we will see you guys in the next video. Bye!